short little video on a few stretches that I highly or recommend to men. Um, of course, women as well. I recommend tons of stretching to men, but these are my top five stretches that really, really tend to help men more so on their tight hamstrings and tight chest muscles, etc. So here we go. Make sure you like the video, comment, leave a message. If there's anything else you'd like to know, I do appreciate it so much. So my first pose is going to be chair pose. Now, traditionally, a lot of times you'll see diagrams of the toes together. This, however, would be mostly for women. So when a man is doing this one, it's okay to keep the feet a little bit further apart. However, you do want to feel as though the toes are kind of pointing in a little bit. Now, what you want to do is bend here, raise the arms up, but very important to engage the back muscles so the arms are coming up towards the ears as much as possible. And then breathe through the nose, exhale, pull the tummy in. Now remember, we're always breathing through the nose using the belly. So five breaths. And second, a forward fold. Very important to inhale, exhale, fold, inhale, halfway up. Now, if you happen to be a man that has very tight hamstrings, it's absolutely okay to bend the knees a little bit. After you're halfway up, exhale, fold, let your arms come to whatever's natural. Inhale again, then exhale, lift the toes and bring the weight forward a little bit. Take your five deep nose breaths and then make sure you bend the knees coming all the way back up and exhaling. Awesome, so that's our number two. Number three is crescent pose. And I love this pose because men have a tendency to have a hard time with their leg back and their hips coming forward. So instead of a warrior where we have to keep our back foot straight, in a crescent pose we can lift, uh oh, blooper, we can lift, Make sure this knee is outward a little bit. Come down, push the hips forward so you feel the piriformis stretch. Look up, reach up, and take your five deep breaths there. Come forward, exhale, and of course, do the other side. Now let's try and keep in mind that we do need to make sure we do these poses as listed, so that way we are warming the muscles correctly. So our pose number four is going to be a boat pose. Now, depending on your level, you'll begin by pulling the shoulders back and down away, just like this, so you can activate your back, almost like you're squeezing a chopstick behind there. Now, you can lift the feet barely off the floor, keeping yourself perfectly in line here. You can either hover, you can start to bring the arms out, and eventually you can start to straighten the legs. Now, very important once you're finished to kind of bring the bottom up a little bit, just to reset the spine. And that will just be sure um, that you don't injure yourself. Of course, each level is very different, so practice with the beginning and whatever you're comfortable with, complete your five breaths. Now our last stretch is for quite a few different things, but it also connects our kinetic chain. What you wanna do is make sure that your back foot is pressing hard from the tip of the toe to the floor. Push your hips forward, move this one out. Take a big breath in, lift the head, tuck the chin, push it forward here. Now either stay here with the shoulders down, lifting the head tall on every inhale and exhaling <sighs> there. Now, if you wanna take this a step further, place the right arm behind you. Inhale, raise up this left arm and go even deeper. Five deep breaths. Before coming out, 
and completing the other side. So that's just a quick little version of a couple of stretches I would definitely recommend for your men out there. So be sure to like the video, subscribe to my channel. I appreciate all your support and let's have a happy November.